You are listening to 40 Weeks with Vanessa Merton, host of the Pregnancy Podcast. Thank you for tuning in to the 40 Weeks Podcast. Welcome to week 25. Your little baby is growing from the size of an ear of corn last week to the size of an acorn squash this week. That little one is getting longer and measures 11.8 inches or 30 centimeters, and they weigh 1.3 pounds or about 600 grams. You already know that your baby's heartbeat can be picked up on a stethoscope, but their little heart is beating so loudly that anyone who presses an ear to your belly should be able to hear it. Your little one can make a fist and reach their feet, and they might even already exhibit a preference for their right or left hand. Your baby's skin is turning pinker due to small blood vessels called capillaries, which are forming under the skin and filling with blood. Your little one is still developing their lungs, and at week 25, they are still very much a work in progress, but they are getting more prepared to breathe air every day. More than half of all pregnant women experience swollen, itchy veins in the rectum area due to increased blood flow to that spot and a bigger uterus pressing down. These are perfect conditions for hemorrhoids. These are a form of varicose veins, and while they don't pose any risk to you or your baby, they can be pretty uncomfortable. Constipation can definitely aggravate these, so prevent that by making sure you're staying hydrated and eating plenty of fiber. Just like about everything else pregnancy-related, they will go away after birth, so this isn't going to last forever, and if you are dealing with hemorrhoids, just hang in there. Tip for dad, you and your wife, girlfriend, or partner need to be on the same page. Have some open discussions. It is totally normal for both of you to find yourselves worrying about your relationship, finances, work, and your baby. Don't stress out. Everything will work out. It seems like a lot in the beginning, but as you go, you're going to learn what you need to do and you're going to find solutions. Having a baby is a major life change and you aren't going to come up with all of the answers overnight. Give yourselves time to figure everything out and keeping an open line of communication will help tremendously with that. If either of you have any doubts or worries, share and work through any concerns together. A healthy relationship with your partner is going to create a really strong foundation and a positive environment for your baby. Thank you for tuning in. Show notes for this episode can be found at pregnancypodcast.com forward slash week 25. Next week, your baby gets blue eyes. And until then, I wish you the very best for your pregnancy journey. There are so many awesome resources available to you at PregnancyPodcast.com, and you can sign up with your email address and your due date to get a weekly email with a link to the episode for your specific week every week in your inbox. I look forward to seeing you in the Pregnancy Podcast Facebook group, which is a great place not only to connect with some other parents-to-be, but also to be able to ask questions and get answers specific to things that you are dealing with and planning for your pregnancy and birth.